Health Q, the place where we try to boost up your health motivation. Today I have got with me chairman from my foundation hospital, Dr. Ram Murthy. Hello sir, thank Hi. you so much for collaborating and allowing uh, us uh, to come here and share this platform with you. It's indeed a pleasure to be with you. Thank you for asking me to join. Thank you sir. Uh, sir, please uh, uh, would you guide us through like what uh, are the new advances that is coming in terms of cataract surgeries since our lot of audience are patients who are looking for answers related to their health topics and they are not aware of what all new advances are coming in terms of any kind of health issues. So our aim is to bring this platform as an upfront where they can learn about all the advances and things that are happening. Uh, cataract surgery has undergone a sea change today and it's no longer a vision restorative surgery but it's a vision enhancing surgery. We don't really wait for patients to develop a mature cataract. Once a patient is not able to do whatever he or she is accustomed to doing, whether it's driving or playing golf or stitching or cooking, we go ahead and operate. So there's no really a lower age limit. It only depends upon the patient's comfort level. And secondly, as far as the intraocular lenses has become the norm, almost every patient who undergoes a cataract surgery gets a lens implanted. It's normally these days done after a procedure called phaco emulsification where ultrasound is used. Today in Eye Foundation and a few other places, we do what's called the laser refractive cataract surgery where we, apart from using the ultrasound, we also use the laser as a modality. Basically, the incisions, the capsular rexes, the nucleus splitting up into small bits and pieces is all done by the laser and the entire process is image guided. We exactly position all our uh, incisions and other uh, rexes that needs to be formed and subsequently just fire the laser and the whole procedure is over in about a couple of minutes and subsequently we just take the patient on to the theater and remove the lens and implant the lens. Because of this the precision, the repeatability, the predictability and the outcomes have significantly enhanced and also the patients are able to get back to almost a normal routine. Uh, their very next day, whether it's uh, going to the office or cooking or uh, taking a head bath, we allow almost all these things that are right from the next day. Other important aspect where a change has occurred is in the type of intraocular lenses that we implant. Cataract basically occurs because there is a we have a natural lens which becomes opaque. So this needs to be removed and we are replacing it with an artificial lens. Normally we were replacing it with lenses which uh, could give good vision for distance so that reading was necessary. But today we have something called multifocal intraocular lenses which we use widely. Once implanted, not only for distance and near, but also intermediate. It's almost like a progressive glasses where whether it's uh, looking at the TV or looking at driving or uh, looking at your laptop or what you want to read, mm -hmm. you have a continuous range of vision. Okay. And if you have a cylindrical power in your cornea, mm -hmm. that can be corrected by something called a toric intraocular lens. Okay. So because of this, these also have certain properties yeah. to enhance the quality of vision. Okay. So 80-year-old today who is getting a cataract surgery mm -hmm. can almost hope to get back the kind of vision he or she enjoyed yeah. at the age of 20. Okay. That's the age when every individual has the the best quality of vision and that's something that's possible today. True, true. That's absolutely. That's really amazing sir. Uh, that means that now at the age of 80 you uh, people can have the vision that they have at the age of 20. That's really amazing. Uh, looking forward for more insights from this event. Thank you so much sir for collaborating with us. Thank, Thank you, you sir. Thank you. Hello everyone. Uh, I'm Dr. Shreyas Ramamurthy from the Eye Foundation, Coimbatore. Uh, the Eye Foundation is a group of tertiary eye care hospitals spread across Tamil Nadu, Karnataka and Kerala. Today I'm here to talk to you about 
the latest revolution in cataract surgery, which is the laser refractive cataract surgery, which has been recently launched at the Eye Foundation Bangalore. What does the laser cataract surgery really do differently? Essentially, in cataract surgery, we have a series of delicate and fine maneuvers which are performed by the surgeon sequentially to ensure a safe and good outcome is produced. The major steps include creating a precise circular opening over the cataract which is like a bag placed inside the eye. Once that opening is made, the cataract can be broken down into small pieces and has to be removed using ultrasound energy. What the laser is precisely doing is taking out the human element from the surgery even before the patient can enter the operating theatre by using this precise and accurate laser energy we are actually able to make the precise openings that we require chop down a hard cataract into multiple pieces and then shift the patient into the OR where it becomes exceedingly easy and exceedingly repeatable to remove those already pre-chopped pieces and then place in a fine intraocular lens to ensure that the patient has a very good and crystal clear vision on day one. Some of the major advantages of laser cataract surgery is the reduced amount of inflammation from the surgery. That is, a patient's cornea, which is the front layer of the eye, is crystal clear even on day one after surgery. It enables them to get back to their daily routines much faster. They can get back to their normal lives even on day one. This greatly improves not only the quality of vision that we can provide to the patients in the immediate period but also in the later period. Using lasers, we can fashion very precise cuts on the cornea which greatly uh, improves the amount of spectacle independence that the patient has after surgery. They can see both distance and near very clearly without the use of glasses. This is the use of laser technology with the availability of the advanced intraocular lenses which we have today can really ensure that the patient even at the age of 70 or 80 can attain the vision that a 20 year old has and enjoy life even at that particular age. So in summary, laser cataract surgery gives us accurate, precise, repeatable, reproducible outcomes but most importantly improves the safety of the surgery.